I'm totally tired of this background, aren't you guys? Perfect. Welcome back to Ambitious Vapor. What up, ladies and gentlemen? Hope you guys are having a good day, man. So, uh, yeah, my new spot, I moved. I'm in the process of still moving, but I wanted to put out a review for you guys. So, uh, this is going to be like the new spot. I'm going to fix it up. I'm going to get some... Uh, black uh it's probably echoey excuse the noise it's probably going to sound a lot different but i'm in the process of uh making it work correctly it's not about that today is a review on the bj box mods admiral 2700 mechanical mod very similar to the broadside you remember the broadside well we got a 2700 so I purchased this bad boy at uh, Vape National Expo, Vape Northeast 2017. It was this past weekend. I went over there. I purchased this at a wholesale price for 100 Okay, these are normally going to be going for about $170. they are not for sale yet. Uh, they're going to be on sale very soon. But the retail companies are going to be putting them on sale before bj box mods does so it's going to be very soon it might be today it might have just posted it some other places you might be able to find it a million different places are going to have this you can get it in three different colors as of right now i have the brass you can get copper and then you can get white brass i was going to get the white brass but i was told that the brass hits harder than the white brass but the white brass is very nice as well so depending on what you like that might be a good color option for you guys to choose. So this is a very unique mechanical, all right? Um, it doesn't have a magnet. It doesn't have a spring. It uses a clutch system switch. So it's three pieces, I'm going to show you down low, that is held on by an O-ring. And no matter where you hit it, it's going to fire, okay? But the best firing location is directly in the center. So all three make a contact and you get the best uh, connectivity that you possibly can. Really nice mechanical guys. This isn't a hybrid. This has a 510 on top. They're all silver plated contacts throughout this mechanical. Um, what else can I tell you on the specs? You can also get um, acrylic resin uh, switches that are $15 extra as well. I have one on there right now. I have the Reload RDA on top. Half Moon Mods Goon Tip. Uh, I think it matched perfectly. And uh, what else can I really tell you about it? You can use 18650s with this as well. Okay, it comes with an additional sleeve tube that will be inside. Comes with two additional O rings. I'll give you all that good stuff down low. But um, you can. Use 18650s with this as well. Now, with that sleeve, it's going to be a lot safer if you have a tear in your battery. But if you use the 2700 and you have a tear, I wouldn't do it, okay? Because it's going directly, there's no sleeve. You have to take the sleeve out to put the 2700 in, and you'll get a short if you use it with a tear in the sleeve. So just be vigilant on that, all right? This does come with a 2700. Uh, iJoy 3000 milliamp hour 30 amp true 2700 battery included with this mechanical. So that's really nice as well. All right. That is a big, big up from BJ Box Mods for doing that. Um, so if you don't have a 2700 and you want to get it and you want to try a 2700 and you like it and you want to get a mechanical, it's great because it comes with it. I think that's awesome some dual aliens in this bad boy i mean i got a serious build in this right now and uh let's have a quick vape baby mm. you want to run this positive down so if it does vent it's going to vent away from your face and your eyes all right, that's what this is made for. The broadside and the Admiral, which is this, is made to run batteries positive down. But what we're going to do 
is we're going to dive down to the table. I'm going to show you everything about this mechanical. I'm going to take the mech fully apart, show you all the pieces that it comes with, show you the battery, give you some information on the 2700 battery because they're new. I want to give you some info on it. Come back up top and I'll give you my final thoughts and we'll wrap it up. All right, that's what we're going to do. So sit back, relax, grab a vape squad. Let's dive down and check out the Admiral 2700 mech mod. Excuse the echo if there's echo. I just moved, getting used to the new setup. But I wanted to do this review for you guys. All right. So this is on the. Uh, this is on the BJ Box Mods Admiral Mechanical. Very similar to the broadside. All right. But this is a 2700 capable mechanical all right so this is the battery that it will come with okay it's the ijoy 2700 3000 milliamp hour high rate 30 amp battery this is not a 40 amp battery okay i don't know what the deal is with ijoy and these chinese companies trying to rep amperage that it's technically not okay that's false advertisement um I wish iJoy wouldn't do that, uh, you know, but this is a rewrap, okay, obviously. I don't know the exact, it could be the Sanyo 2700B, but it could not be, I'm not sure, but it's a 2700 battery that comes with the mechanical. It's a 30 amp, it is not a 40 amp, but it is a true 30 amp battery. It's a very good battery, okay? So it's gonna come with this, all right? I wanted to make sure that you guys knew, okay? So, we'll go over this in a second, all right? But it's gonna come in this beautiful broadside Admiral packaging. These are not out yet. All right, it does say broadside up top. It does come in a, a bunch of colors like I told you. It has their uh, BJ Box Mods logo on the bottom. Okay, I'm gonna open it up. You're going to get this. Okay. Look at in a second. You get this. Admiral. Okay. It's going to give you uh, some information on it. You want to run this. I'll go over this in a second, but you want to run it positive down. Okay. On this. All right. Congratulations. You are the proud new owner of the Broadside Admiral 2700 mod. Just gives you, uh, you know how to use it okay suggested batteries to use and you're also going to get two o-rings okay the alrighty these o-rings are for the throat and you also get this authenticity certificate the bearer of this card has received a certificate genuine broadside mod the certificate confirms that it has been subjected to the most demanding quality control process and guarantees it meets the highest of standards Approved by uh, the signature, serial number is 112, and the date is April 13th, 2017. Okay? So it's really nice that they give you that as well. It's going to come in this felt. So, here it is, ladies and gentlemen. The Admiral. All right, this is very similar to the... Uh, the broadside. All right, it's 25 millimeters in diameter. It's a non-hybrid connection, okay? And it, you can use 2700s and 18650s in it, all right? So on the bottom, it does say Admiral, okay? That is the uh, silver-plated 510 connection. You don't have to uh, adjust that. That self-adjusts to the atomizer. If you push down on that, it will fall through. Okay, and that is the throw. All right, it does come with this black one. All right, it does come with that black one, but I did buy an additional. And these are uh, acrylic resin buttons for $15 that you can purchase as well. All right, so I picked up an additional button. 
Now that throw is going to be a little bit different when you first get it. All right, but after a while, that O-ring loosens up a little bit and it does get a little bit better. But at the beginning, it is tight and it's a little, as you can hear, a little grungy, okay? That's the inside we'll look at in one second. That is the top, the 510. You'll put your atomizer on. I'll just take this one for now. The reload. Okay, and then that will adjust. And then you adjust this accordingly to the battery rattle. Okay, that's all silver plated as well. So what you do, you can pop that back in. I'm gonna take the, uh, the new Paradigm. Pandora, I'm sorry, the new Pandora, and uh, I'm going to throw that on there. All right, that does adjust accordingly, okay? Reverse threaded on this, okay? See, righty loosey. Okay, and that's the 510. It's all silver plated. Okay, the tube itself, that's going to fit a normal 2700 inside, but if you don't have a 2700, even though it does come with one, if that's charging and you want to use an 18650, you can. All right, that's what this sleeve is for. Silver plated, all right, that's silver plated as well. Okay, and that's, that's also going to help with um, if you have a cut in your battery. All right, that's what it's for. But if you say if you have a cut on that battery, okay, somewhere, that's going to help uh, from shorting by using this tube. If you use the regular 2700, okay, there's no, there's no insulator inside. So make sure, definitely make sure you have no cuts or tears inside because if you do, actually you want to put positive down. If you do, you can get a hot short, all right? And you can just kill the battery, all right? It's a very snug fit, which I like, okay? So now, it is serialized, 112, to take apart the switch, all right? That button just comes right out. I like that. That's the acrylic resin button very they have a lot of different colors to choose from i thought that was nice so i went with that one it's going to come with the black one all right it just sits in there nicely you can also clean those threads up as well but it is good machining all right it is going to patina okay and here is the innovation of the broadside and it's came over to the admiral so no matter where you hit it it's gonna fire okay a lot of ones you have to you guys know you have to get it right you know you have to get it in a perfect spot for it to fire but on this one i mean you can hit it anywhere and it's gonna fire the best connectivity you're gonna get is in the center so it does that okay and that is the o-ring that does come off it's a clutch system throw okay very innovative that's the holes for ventilation that's for venting is on the bottom there's no ventilation up top there's ventilation on the bottom and this is all silver plated okay so let me give you a little bit of information there's three points of contacts on this as you saw one two and three no springs and magnets needed this helps to reduce hot buttons and misfires so this doesn't misfire because of that. There's that red O-ring in there. And then it comes down. It's like a conical dome. And that O-ring makes it retract back. That O-ring is very important. That's what's making it fire and then coming back to not fire. You have that silver plated piece as well that you can take out. You can pop that right out. That's the silver that's a nice contact, silver plated. Okay, very, very nice. 
and then there's the delrin. The venting, like you see here, is so it's downward and away from your face and eyes. That's why they put the ventilation. This is a very safe device. A lot of devices either go for hard hitting or safe or sometimes in the middle. A little bit hard and a little bit safe. This one is directly very, very safe. And I think they did a good job at hitting hard as well. And if you wanted to take that out, you just take like your... Uh, like this, okay? You take that piece right out, okay? There's the holes for ventilation. This is Delrin threads. That is everything that you're gonna get with it. See, I mean, I bought that, so you'll get this. You, you, it comes with a battery, all right? All the pieces fully taken away, and that is the solid tube brass tube okay so to put it back together take that piece put that in nice take your contact you pop it on I, I want I like to get the fingerprints off that so there's just a good connectivity you don't want any oil or anything like that getting on there. Take your switch. Pop it in there like so. Very nice. Okay. Put an atomizer on there. Positive down. All right, guys, let's go back up top and let's vape on this. I'll give you my final thoughts. I'll see you guys in a minute. The Admiral Mechanical, how do I feel about it? I was gonna get the white brass, but I heard from BJ Box Mods that the white brass is not gonna hit as hard as the brass. Um, I love how you can buy additional throws, the, dish, the, the additional acrylic resin throws on the bottom. They're $15 a pop, they have a bunch of different colors to choose from. I definitely like that as well, it's really nice. It hits beautifully, I love that it's a 2700. Uh, I love how they did that. It's also compatible with the 18650s. In case you run out of juice, you can throw an 18650 and rock it as well. This is 25 millimeters in diameter, same as the broadside. So 25s are going to look the best. 24s don't look bad at all. That's a 24 and it looks nice. You're gonna get 3,000 milliamp hours on the the iJoy battery. Okay, it's also gonna come in like a uh, a battery holder, like a plastic battery holder that says broadside on it. It's just upstairs. I didn't grab it. It does come with that as well, with some battery instructions inside. It's gonna come with one 2700. All right, still very nice. I definitely like it. The threading, the machining on this is quality, A plus quality. Um, I can't say anything bad about the engineering behind it, the looks of it. It's just gorgeous. It's very simplistic. I love what they did with the uh, the switch. It's the same broadside switch. I like it. It's a little bit at the beginning. It's a little tight. It's a short throw. But no matter where you hit it, it will fire. But you definitely want to hit it in the center to get the best, most connectivity out of it. So that all three open up and press and all three of the clutch system throw touches and makes a connection evenly. You know, that's just the, the best way. But it, it, it will fire no matter where you hit it. I just hit it on the corner and it fires beautifully. So that's a big pro. I love the throw on this. I love the innovation behind it. Everybody loved the broadside and now I can definitely see why everybody loved it. I didn't have the broadside. Those batteries I think run about $11 a pop. So 
Um, it's $170 for this mechanical, so it'd probably be about uh, $159 roughly for the mechanical itself, and then you're getting that battery with it. So it's $170. Now, I know some of the broadsides started at like $130 and then went up to $250. Uh, so th I think this is a little bit more expensive than the broadside, but I think it's worth it. I like 2700. I do. This thing is, it definitely has better battery life than a single 18650 mech. Fire's great. No misfires, no hot button, good threads. Comes with two additional O-rings in case this one breaks. You can pop another one in there and then you have another backup. That's a pro. You can see the holes for ventilation in the Delrin facing down. So it's going to vent outwards, which is very, very nice. I don't want something venting in my face. So I like that as well. Now I hope, BJ Box Mods, I know you're probably paying attention. It would be nice if you made an additional hybrid connection. Because this is threadable. So I think it might be a good idea. I don't know if it would work. I really don't know if it would work. But if you could make it work somehow, it'd be maybe nice to make a hybrid connection. But with that said, a lot of people do like 510 connections and you do not have to worry about the protruding 510 pin using the Admiral or the broadside. Okay, you can throw anything on there, any atomizer you want, and it's definitely 100% safe. Okay, so I have to give it a big up and a big pro for that as well. Um, it looks nice. Um, it's going to patina. You, you know, you're going to have to take care of it. You can buy additional. I love how you can buy additional sw switches for it. That's just money. I mean, you could do matchy-matchy for, for days. The drip tip and the switch matchy-matchy. It doesn't get hot. When I'm chain vaping it, like I'm chain vaping it now, it doesn't get hot. It gets maybe a little bit warm. But it does not get hot. That's a pro as well. I'm very happy with my purchase, ladies and gentlemen. I'm very, very fucking happy with my purchase. I think this is a phenomenal mechanical. Um, I bought some other mechanicals up there as well that are like triple the price of this. And this one is definitely, definitely nice. And the throw's got a click to it. It's a little bit clicky. It's a little firm, not too firm. I like the throw on it. I do. No matter where I hit it, it fires. You can feel it. It's definitely a different type of throw compared to other mechanicals with magnets and springs. It's, it's different, okay? So just be vigilant in mind and um, just keep that in mind when you go to purchase one of these or if you're looking to purchase it, it's a different type of throw. So it might be a little bit different. It's subjective. You might like it. You might not. I like it. I enjoy it. Really nice. I don't know what else to tell you about this one. Uh, this is definitely Ambitions Vapor approved. Uh, it gets my stamp of approval, most definitely. Two stamps, 100%. And uh, you're going to be seeing a lot of this on my Instagram, man. Now, where you can find it, it's going to be on bjboxmods.com. It's going to be at some other vendors as well. Just Google it, all right? I'm not exactly sure. I'll do a little bit of Googling for you. I'll put some links if I can find them. I don't think I'll find any, but if I do, I'll put it in the description for you. But definitely follow me on my Facebook group. It's in the description. Um, I've been talking about the move. I'm posting pictures. I'm going to do like a vape tour of the new setup for you guys. Um, check, up, check me out on my Instagram as well. I post all these things that I got at the Vape Expo. Um on there as well okay that's what i got for you today squad i hope you found the video helpful if or informative if you did consider subscribing i mostly give you content daily 1080p 60 frames i did move i did go on a vape expo so lately it hasn't been daily but i usually do all right don't waste your effing bandwidth not being subscribed to the channel you can subscribe down there, and I have some two additional videos up top to check out as well that I recently done. The Reload RTA, I would definitely go out and check that one as well. Stay juiced up, squad. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.